Meaty political ad thanks Republican Congressman Eric Paulson because he voted for tax cuts. It claims taxpayers in Paulson's district get a $5,000 tax cut. Is that true? We asked Pat Kessler for a reality check. The ad is produced by the Republican Super PAC Conservative Leadership Alliance, claiming families in Congressman Paulson's district are getting an average $5,000 federal tax cut, thanks to Paulson. The historic tax cuts are helping the middle class, and Congressman Eric Paulson helped make them happen. The average family here is saving over $5,000. On average, it's true, according to the House Ways and Means Committee. It applies to Paulson's third congressional district, where half of the families make more than $140,000 a year and half make less. Families earning $140,000 could see an average $5,000 tax cut. But averages are deceptive. Everybody gets a tax cut, but they are skewed heavily toward wealthy taxpayers. The top 20% of earners gets 65% of the tax cuts. And in Congressman Paulson's district, the difference in tax cuts is dramatic. Families earning fifty to seventy-five thousand dollars get an average tax cut of fourteen hundred bucks a year. Seventy-five to a hundred thousand, nineteen hundred dollars. One hundred to two hundred thousand dollars, twenty-five hundred dollars a year tax cut. But if you earn more than two hundred thousand dollars, the average tax cut is twenty-two thousand dollars. But Nancy Pelosi is promising to roll back these tax cuts. The ad accuses Democrats of wanting to raise taxes, but the Republican tax cuts will disappear on their own. They are scheduled to expire in 10 years. That's Reality Check.